So something strange is moving through our solar system right now. It's an object from beyond the stars, traveling at over 130,000 miles per hour, and it's not acting like anything we've ever seen before. This interstellar visitor named 3i Atlas isn't just reflecting sunlight like a comet should, it appears to be generating its own light. And that's not even the worst part. Harvard astrophysicist Avi Loeb is openly asking whether this glow could mean one thing. And you guessed it, alien technology. And with a close flyby of Mars just weeks away, NASA is scrambling to point its spacecraft towards the anomaly. So what exactly is 3i Atlas? A comet, a stellar fragment, or something far more extraordinary? Let's go ahead and break this down. So my name is Tom. I'm with the Daily Bellway. I'm also publisher of the Illinois Review and a White House correspondent for the Next News Network. And make sure you guys hit subscribe. We're a growing channel, and every like, comment, and subscription helps us grow. And it's only possible through you. So 3i Atlas was first spotted by NASA's Atlas Survey, designed to catch near-Earth objects. And right away, astronomers knew it was something different. It was hyperbolic trajectory confirmed it was interstellar, meaning it came from outside our solar system. Only two such objects have ever been recorded before. I'm not even going to try to say, I'm terrible with names, O-U-M-A-U-M-U-A, Oumuamua in 2017, and Borisov in 2019. At first, it looked like a comet, but then things got weird. Instead of a bright comet tail trailing behind it, it had a faint coma, but no tail at all. And the little outgassing it did show pointed towards the sun and not away from it. That's like the opposite of normal. Its color was unusually red, even even redder than the darkest known asteroids. And then came the glow. The brightness was far too intense for its estimated size, and scientists calculated that if it were reflecting light, it would need to be 100 kilometers across. But images suggest something closer to 20 kilometers, and the math doesn't add up. And we've got a video here talking exactly about the everything going on with it. Check out. This object. However, at this time, NASA still is not aggressively exploring these possibilities. That being the case, then we have to go with what we've got. And one thing that we do have is an analysis of the brightness profile of the glow of 3i Atlas. And have a look at this figure, something that's actually a little difficult to interpret. And I have a hard time interpreting it also. But the one thing to keep in mind is how steep the slope is. It is a projected power law slope of negative three, which implies a three-dimensional emissivity profile with a radial power law slope of negative four. Now, what all that garbage means is that this object has a much steeper light curve than we have observed in natural comets. So together with a colleague named Eric Quito, Avi Loeb realized that the observed slope of negative four is consistent with an alternative model in which the dust outflow around 3i Atlas is being illuminated by a central source. In other words, this object is creating its own light, not reflected light, light being generated by the object itself. This that is just insane. So Loeb suggests in early August that 3i Atlas could be producing its light from within, possibly through radio radioactive decay or chemical processes. But he didn't rule out that the artificial... Like, in fact, he raised the possibility of a nuclear-powered spacecraft, which they probably have better technology than that. So let me ask you, do you think this is a comet, or could it be something more? Drop your thoughts in the comments below and let me know. And this is where everything changes. NASA has already tasked the Mars Reconnaissance Orbiter to capture images when 3i Atlas flies by Mars in early October. MAVEN and Europe's Mars Express may also observe. For the first time, humanity could get a close look at an interstellar visitor while it's still inside our solar system. And the media's reactions were, of course, crazy. Uh, the New York Post compared the glow to headlights in space. Daily Mail said scientists are baffled. Futurism raised the nuclear spacecraft theory. And Vice admitted the natural explanations do not add up neatly. Meanwhile, social media is on fire. Some call it wormwood, tying it to biblical prophecy. Others think it's a mothership preparing to launch probes near Mars. And of course... The king himself, Joe Rogan, has already talked about it on his podcast. But whether it's natural or artificial, the timing is remarkable. Its trajectory puts it near Mars, Venus, and even Jupiter in rare alignments. As Sorry, astronomers call the odds of this less than 2,000. I thought the odds would be a little bit better than that. So is this a coincidence or is there something more? I mean, my opinion is it's probably something that just happened to be the one in a million chance, but... Again, if you guys got value from this news update, tap subscribe. My opinion, where I should be talking about that, is, is next. So here's the bottom line. 
Three Eye Atlas could be a natural fragment glowing because of exotic chemistry or radiation, or it could be something else entirely, like a probe, a craft, or even just a strange cosmic accident. But either way, this matters. It reminds us of how little we truly know about the universe. It challenges scientists to think beyond safe assumptions, and it forces our republic to consider what we would do if one day we confirmed that something like artificial or alien was passing through our skies. And I believe in American strength and leadership in space, but things like this do take an entire world and we're not prepared. But President Trump has already emphasized the importance of space defense, exploration, and dominance. And if 3i Atlas is natural or space program, you know, we will gain invaluable knowledge. And if not, it's even more critical that America and not China or Russia take the lead in discovery and defense. And apparently they're pretty good about getting information out about UFOs, but not the Epstein files. Let me know your thoughts about that in the comment, because every video I put up is what about Epstein, and I could not agree more. And I cover the White House quite frequently, and we ask every single time we're there, because we're just as pissed off as you guys are. So please stay aware, stay informed, and stay ready, because whatever 3 Eye Atlas turns out to be, it's proof that we live in a universe full of mis mysteries waiting to be uncovered. And I kind of hope it's aliens. I mean, if we thought 2020 was bad, this is going to be crazy. God bless.